Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. Right, I'm just about to get in the bath, so I thought I'd come on and say good morning. It is, I'm starting this vlog on Tuesday. I wasn't doing anything yesterday, so I thought there's no point vlogging, but today um, I've done a bit of tidying up this morning. Um, Hoover the stairs. Um, is I'm starting this vlog on Tuesday. I wasn't doing anything yesterday, so I thought there's no point vlogging. But today, um, I've done a bit of tidying up this morning. Um, Hoover the stairs. Um, I still got to put Isabel's stuff in the attic, so I'm gonna try and do that later. But I've got to wait for my husband to get back from work. And then I can open up the attic door because it's a, bit, it's a bit of a struggle. So I'm going to have a bath and then um, I'll jump on when I'm doing my makeup and have a little bit of a chat with you. Um, I'm just going to put my lenses in. Look away if you don't like people touching their eyes. Um, but I need to put my lenses in to have a bath. I don't. I can't have a bath without my lenses in because I can't see a bloody thing. And I can't do it with glasses because then I won't be able to see. What was this? Four. So four is my right eye. So it's minus four. And this is minus 3.75. Wow, I look horrendous today. I've just been tidying up, so I'm a wee bit of a sweaty mess. I've just um, put some of the nails ink. Sorry about the, the bits round my nails. I bite the skin round them, but I've put on um, the nails ink. I think it's repair therapy on my nails and they look really nice. Like the, the actual shine on them, it looks really good. So I've just done that. Um, what I'm gonna do now, I think, I'm going to put a face mask on. Oh, where's my face mask brush? How about you got a brush in it somewhere? Oh, I think I might use this in the bath as well. My body shop strawberry soap. Um, right, just one minute, guys. I'm trying to find my face mask brush. Yes. This is the one. I don't know why my foundation brushes in here, but I need to give that one a, a bit of a clean. I'm, I've been missing this for ages. I must have bought it in here to clean and then just stuck it on my, um, in my little thing there. I don't even know what I'm saying now, but I'm just grab a towel. Right. Give that a little dry. Yeah, I thought I'd put, um, a face mask while I'm in the bath. My skin isn't too bad. I've literally got um, probably a little bit here, but these are scars. So I need I need to get something for um, scars really. And then I'm going to use this Generation Clay face mask if I've got enough left. I'm going to try and wax some of this on. So what's everyone been doing? Has anyone got any plans for this week? Um, it's the 25th of January today. So yeah, we're nearly at the end of January. It's Isabel's 13th birthday. Or would have been 13th birthday on the 3rd of Feb. So, that's going to be uh, a hard day for us. Um, it would have been turning into a teenager. So, she's always been very grown up her age anyway. Um, she started talking when she was, she must have been probably seven eight months old it might have even been younger than that um my son was the same 
um, they both started working unaided probably about I think they're about 13 months old um, yeah and I know if my mum is watching this she'll be laughing her head off because I wouldn't walk without holding a little finger or, or a hand and I could walk I just wouldn't and I could talk as well but I used to do this little whingy thing when I wanted something and just point and whinge which is is not it's not like me because I am a chatterbox so I don't know why I would like that I'm gonna put this brow on my nose like this because I get quite oily around my nose. Uh, yeah, I think I've got just, just enough. So I'm gonna squeeze a little bit more out. This stuff's dead good. I've got this in a glossy box. I'm not sure how much it is actually. I think it's quite expensive. I'll have to have a look because I do really like it. It's the Australian one. Yeah, made in Australia. Uh, so I'm using my uh, phone as a mirror. I broke my little bathroom mirror, which is oh, really bad, bad luck, isn't it? How much bad luck, how much more bad luck could I have? I couldn't have it, I was cleaning. No, I wasn't. I was, I'd filled up quite a spider plant next to me here on the, um, windowsill and one day I watered it and I filled it up too much so I thought I'm going to have to tip some water out so as I went to lift it off and tip it the mirror just fell off fell in the bath and smashed so yeah I'd, I'd had that for a while I think I got it from Ikea so I do need to get another one I have actually got a big mirror here on the wall there look and there's my spider plant there's all my crap there you are placed in a toothbrush holder. Um, what what else I want to use in the bath um, on my hair is this uh, Brave New Hair Keratin Mask Concentrate for instant smooth and Brazilian hair with keratin, amino acids, baobab and tamanu. I'm not sure what that is. Let me see that. Why is it not big? So, there we go. So it says to apply after using keratin shampoo. Well, I've got a keratin shampoo. I'm going to be using the LV Weightless Nourishing Shampoo Refined Coconut Oil. I love that one. So I'll be using that and then put this on and you just leave it on for five minutes and then rinse off. So, Oh, it smells nice. Like tropical coconut tea. So yeah, I'm gonna use that. And then when I get out of the bath, I like to moisturize. So I'm gonna use this one. All of this stuff I've got in um, the glossy box. So this is the Neo Bay Natural and Organic Bright Empathy Orange Vitamin C Body Milk. Mm -hmm. uh, this smells like oranges really really nice i have used this already i got out of the bath the other day so yeah looking forward to putting that on and then i think i want to put some of this on my face and i might put some down my neck and um, maybe a bit on my arms because um i'm just looking a bit pasty when i put my foundation on and i'm blending it in i just you know my neck's really pale so this is really good this is so it's a moisturising lotion, a gradually build a natural looking tan. So yeah, I like it on my face. My whole body is good, but there's no point doing my whole body. I'm not going to be getting anything else out. So as you can see, my face mask is drying down. So if I have a bath and then at the end I'll wash it out. And um, I'll see you guys in a bit. Right, I'm back. I'm out the bath. 
just ignore what's going on behind me on the bed because I've got sheets on there and clothes to put away. I'm going to be changing my bed sheets in a minute. Well, in a minute, I'll say after I've done this. Um, I've just been picking my skin. That's why I'm all red, as I do. I don't know why I do it because then I moan about my skin being bad. So I need to leave it alone. I'm just going to use my micellar water. This is the oil infused one. Um, my face mask. It felt nice when it came off and then I used my cleansing bar that I got in the glossy box. Um, which I use every day. It's really good, that cleansing bar. It makes you, your skin feel so clean. Now, I think See, look, it's still got some dirt. It's crazy. The amount of stuff I've done on my face this morning. I've actually used... Oh, my lens nearly went funny then. I've actually used some of this this morning already. Um, And it's still... I don't know if it's like my natural oils coming off or something. I, I don't know. Um, let's put my lenses away. Down here. Yeah, look at all of it. Look at that. I've got a towel here. Just a mess. So I cleaned my um, foundation brush. Well, I've, I've, I've got to use the um, the proper brush cleaner, but I've, I've cleaned it as much as I could with my hand. Um, so I'm going to use that for my foundation. I've just got off the phone to my sister-in-law. She's just about to go look at a new car. And then she's popping round for a cuppa, a cup of coffee. I've got no tea. She doesn't normally drink tea anyway, but I do. But no one can have like a coffee, so we'll be drinking coffee. I told Matthew um, went out this morning, got me some breakfast. Um, and I said, can you grab some milk and some tea bags? You come back with milk and bread. <laughs> As they do, as the men do, don't listen, but I, we actually needed bread anyway. But then he brought back soya bread. I don't even know what it is, but I'm sure it's nice. I'll eat it anyway. I think for toast or something, seeded and soya bread. Uh, yeah. And I'll just put some of my Pantan oil on my wet hair. So I use some wet and dry hair. So, just whack that in. I think I'm going to do... I'm going to do my makeup first and then dry my hair after. Um, just put some of this in. This is my heat protection mm. spray by Schwarzkopf. I'll put a bit in now and then I'll put a bit in when I dry and straighten my hair. So... What am I going to do today? I'm going to go for quite a natural look today, I think. I've got some of my cocoa butter on my lips. That's what I put on day and night. Oh, I'm going to put a bit of this on. That's what I said I was going to do. So I'm going to put it on my face and my neck. And then go and wash my hands because it will stain your hands. And I don't want it to stain my pretty nails that I've done at the moment. These are actually my nails. I never grow my nails, so I'm very proud of myself. If I do say so myself, very proud. As you can see, I am, I'm in a quite good mood today. I don't know why it could change, but at the moment, I feel okay. Um, I've been taking a higher dose of my antidepressants. The doctor put them up. I had a really good chat with the doctor the other day. So I'm just um I'm just putting a few layers on, just build it up. And I'll let it dry down a bit before I put my um makeup on. Put it right on there. Trying to my chest. So I'll be back in a minute. So I'm just gonna just leave my hair wet. Probably let it dry naturally a bit. Hmm, what am I going to put on? I think 
think I might put on some of my BB cream, medium one. Just going to be a little bit darker. I'll put some um, some concealer on as well. So yeah, I'm just feeling like I'm in a bit of a bit. I look quite dark, does not it? It's blended in. Yeah, I'm in a bit of a better mood today. Um, I think it's because when I got up, I got up quite early this morning. I got up at half six, and I started um, tidying up, um, and then sat down to have a um, a coffee with Matty um, while he was waking up on the sofa, and. And then when he left for work, after I'd ironed his clues, because he's still got a bad back, so I ironed his stuff and he left for work. And he was going to go to his office in Solly Hall, but he went and got me some breakfast, brought it back, and got my prescription for me. And the bread and milk even though I asked for tea bags and milk but anywho and then he went to the Coventry office because so, he had a meeting my son works at the Coventry one so bump it to his dad there um yeah he's, a, he's Matthew's a manager for the Solly Hall one um he used to be a manager at the Coventry one until he left and went to another company which was based in Scotland so he worked a lot from home and then you may have seen from other vlogs that um, I went to Scotland with him um, and then he, he came back to work for this company and they would swap things around a bit so he went to work for the Sally Hall one which he, he still works from home a lot anyway because of Covid he doesn't go in that much. Um, so I keep saying um again. I keep saying um. So annoying. So yeah, he's gone into he's gone into the office. So he probably won't be there all day. I wouldn't have thought. But his back's still quite bad. I don't know if I've mentioned on here, but he had an MRI scan. Um, we're just waiting for the doctor to call and give him the results because we did, he did have a message, I think, to say to book an appointment a couple of weeks ago, um, saying that, um, I'm saying them again, saying that there was something showing up on the scan because he basically collapsed in the kitchen. When was that? It was, it was either October or November last year. He collapsed in the kitchen and my, my son wanted to call an ambulance, but he said no. So my, my son um, managed to get him in the car and take him to hospital, take him to Oney. And he was put on um, a morphine drip. Um, so, yeah, we, he, he was in absolute agony. He really was. Uh, it's not too... I think it's coming up quite orange on here because of the light. So it's not too bad. I mean, when that tan um, sets in, which it doesn't actually take that long, it should blend into my neck. Where's my little brush gone from my powder? Have a bit of... Is that it? No. Where's my little one? Brush under my eyes. Just putting on some my Lottie London powder. Just to uh, what do you call it? Set it. This smells really nice, this um BB cream. I always took this on holiday. I didn't wear makeup throughout the day but at night I'd want to put a bit on and you don't want to put thick foundation especially in a hot country so I'd used to put this 
don't know what happened there, but my uh, camera just turned off. So yeah, one holiday I used to put a bit of the BB cream on and concealer and just do my eyebrows and some mascara and that's that's all I'd put on. I'm going to do my eyebrows now. Where's my eyebrow pencil? Where's everything going missing? I need another eyebrow pencil. I don't... Not eyebrow pencil. Eyebrow brush. Because I'm using pomade. Do you know what? I, I did a vlog. Was it last week that I did it? Where I said that I'd order... I thought I'd ordered some new foundation. The Revolution. Um, the new Revolution one and a brow pencil and then i was thinking well i haven't even brushed them up yeah i thought where where's this stuff that i ordered because usually i'll just come within a couple of days and it was off beauty bay and yeah i've had beauty bay stuff before and it's come really quick so i, I went on and checked it was still in the basket. I, I hadn't even ordered it. So, I'm a bit skint now. So, I'm going to wait until the hubby gets... I think he gets paid today. Get some Wonga off him and uh, get it ordered. Because I was, I was waiting for that. And there was someone else I wanted to order. Oh, I did order um, a new phone case and screen protector for both of us because we both just got an iPhone 13 mini, which is what I'm recording on now. So I've got so much more storage. And I don't know, tell me if you think. Do you think, do you think it's clearer? You can see the ring light in my eyes. Are. Do you think the recordings are clearer now? I definitely think it, um, like picture wise, it's better. And also, as well, we can hear my voice clearer on it. So, oh, yeah, I'm, I am loving this phone at the minute, but I haven't got a case for it. I haven't got a screen protector. Um, hopefully, they'll come in tomorrow. I'm just so worried about dropping it. I just want to wear. Uh, protect my new phone so what i did is i took over I'm not sure if i said this in my last one I probably didn't i've taken over my daughter's contract when i say my daughter's contract it was obviously a contract in my name my daughter was only 11 but it was it was the one that i got for my daughter because i already had one so I took a iPhone 7 she had mm. out with O2. And um, yeah, it was a pretty good contract. And, it, and then it was due for an upgrade. So you can normally do it a month early. So I thought, well, I wanted to keep her voicemail and a number. So I thought, well, what I'll do is... I'll cancel mine because mine was due for an upgrade as well. So I've cancelled mine, which is due to um, turn off at the end of this month and taken out this, well, taken over this new one of Izzy's. So when people ring my phone and I don't answer, the voicemail is Izzy. Uh, my sister in law rang the other day and I completely forgot to tell her that I'd, she knew that I'd. Um, kept Isabel's number because I told her but she didn't know that the voicemail was Izzy and I didn't answer the phone and it obviously went through to Izzy's voicemail so she was a bit surprised with that but she said that it, it was lovely to hear her so yeah I've um the people that I've messaged with my new number I have I have warned them that it's Izzy's voicemail. Obviously, I can't tell everyone. I won't be telling like, the doctors and stuff like that. They'll just, they'll know if they ring. I'm just using my old um, instant anti age eraser. I've still got a bit on the sponge just to, 
me not my eyebrows because the pomade smudges sometimes and you need them out a bit but it's one of the highlights of them actually <laughs> yeah so i'm just using the le splash the moonlight glow face palette and I've just used the bronzed goddess one here. And then I'm going to use this blush. I like this blush. It's like a peachy colour. And then the highlight as well. So all this makeup I've got in my drawers. And I'm literally just using one palette. <laughs> so I usually pull it sort of above my bronzer. Like that. It's quite a fluffy brush. And then with the excess, I just go across my nose. Get a little tiny bit more on, and I go across my forehead like that. And bring it down. And then I'm going to use my Spectrum brush that I got in Glossy Box. And use the highlight, and I just put it here. my fluffy beauty bay brush and then i'm going to use the sort of pinky nude and make that very quiet dog's in his bed under my bed because he has his he has his dog bed under my bed he loves it under there i used to just have it on the rug at the end of my bed but he likes to be underneath so he's got his bed padded out he's got my old fluffy cardigan in there and a cushion He's all snuggly wuggly. So there we go for the eyes. So you can still see under the um, the BB cream, you can still see like my natural freckles. So it does look quite natural. Oh, it looks a bit, a bit of a mess on this side. Okay, I'm just going to put some mascara on. I'm, I'm not going to use eyeliner. Or sometimes I use like a dark um, eyeshadow. And I just put a little bit in the corner, but I'm not going to bother. I'm just going to use my mascara. I love this mascara. It's by Essence, the Lash Princess. And I always use the um, waterproof one. Because of the tears. I think I can hear Matty. Pulling up on the... Unless it's someone driving past. I'm sure I can hear him pulling up on the drive. Uh, see what I mean? Look, I'll, I'll go and just put a little bit on, and it's it's really pretty. And it literally is a few quid, about three pound. Oh, this is my second one, and it, it did last me a few months. So, yeah, I highly, highly recommend. So, this essence you can buy from Wilco. And I think I think you can buy it online as well, but I get it from Wilco. All the Essence stuff is good. I really like Essence stuff and the Technic stuff as well. Oh, I don't put anything on my bottom lash. Let's give it a blow dry. Sun's coming up like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door Thank you. 
washing down and I'll see you in a bit. That's the bed made. I know it's creased but I don't wash my I don't wash my bed in. What am I about? I don't iron my bed in. Of course I'll wash it. Mm -hmm. Sides wiped over there and that little one there. I've got my dressing table. I've just got to do the mirror. I've got to go and get the mirror spray. I use those wipes there. Very good. I'm going to wipe that down, that box there, so those need to go into those little face well, um, face cloths need to go in the bathroom and then that box there needs to go in the attic, that's some of Izzy's Christmas stuff that I was on about earlier and then out there on that shoe rack that's got hardly any shoes on it is Marcus's clean washing so that's ready for him to take in his room. Look at this wall, it's ridiculous. It's all patchy. That's That there is where we've wiped it when it was dirty. This is the crappiest paint ever. It's just awful. I cannot wait to decorate this room. This room is actually going to be our dressing room because we're hopefully, fingers crossed, getting the attic done really soon. So right, I'm gonna 
take all this down. This is the rubbish out of the bins upstairs, out of the bathroom bin, all my bedding and a bit of washing. Go downstairs. I might take that cardigan down, stick that on because I'm cold. My sister-in-law should be here soon. Yeah. Katie should be here soon. That's my sister. So I'm going to go put the kettle on. And oh, I wiped all my wardrobes as well. They look a bit cleaner now. They're looking a bit grubby, you know, from fingerprints and stuff. So I'm going to go and stick some washing on, put the kettle on and have a look. What I'm going to have for lunch. Might just have a sandwich or something. Okay. Hello my lovelies, I am so sorry I didn't vlog after I'd spoke to you earlier when I come downstairs because I didn't actually come downstairs, I decided to do my son's bedroom so I'm absolutely shattered now, I've got a pound and headache after I've been doing that all day. What the hell was that? Caught something in the corner of my eye then, shit myself. That was weird. Anyway, I've got I've got Matty's dressing gown on because mine is in the washing machine. I've got to get it out and dry it now. Just washed it today, so it's all fresh. I um I wore it the other day when I had some makeup on and I got it like around here and it just looks scrubby, doesn't it? So right now. Oh, I'm so tired. You look really tired. Look at me. Look so tired. I'm sorry about the lighting. These um spotlights, they're, they're terrible. Terrible lighting. I've got you in the cupboard. See the door, look. That's a bit filthy, look at that. So this is the cupboard that I have my glasses and my cups in. So I thought I'd just stick you in. So I'm going to make some dinner now, but we're all like, I'm feeling a bit, a bit iffy and Marcus and Matty aren't that hungry. So I've got some leeks to make, to use up. So I'm going to make a leek and potato soup. So I made one last week and Marcus absolutely loved it. So yeah, we've got some seeded bread to go with it. Matty's going to pop out to get some croutons. So, yeah, that is what we're gonna have. So, I'm gonna get cracking. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna actually vlog me um, cooking this. I'm. I'm really sorry, guys, but I just want to get it done quickly. And I haven't got my um, my like tripod thing down here. It's upstairs, and I've just been up and down the stairs so many times. So I will definitely vlog it next time. I'm going to start doing some um, vlogging when I'm cooking. Someone asked me on here, commented, saying um, that I should um, record when I'm making my you know, curry. So I don't think I'm making one this week. I normally do them on a Monday, so next Monday I should vlog it. So yeah, I'm gonna get on with this now and I will catch up with you in a bit. I don't make a sound when I shut the door.